California has officially entered phase two of its reopening plan. Welcome back. I'm Stella Escobedo. And I'm Heather Meyer. So what exactly does phase two mean? Well, let's break it down for you this morning. So this means that businesses such as bookstores, clothing stores, toy stores, and florists can reopen for curbside pickup. And that started this morning. News 8's Netta Ron for live in Del Mar for us this morning, where one business's doors is already open and already having customers stop by. Ned, I love to see that. Yeah, they've had customers stop by. These are loyal customers who are really glad to see this store open. It's called Sandcastle. The fish balloon. And take it a look in front of the store here. Practice social distancing. That is the key message they have. They have all of their new safety protocol signage up, just as the governor said they have to do. And the county of San Diego also requiring this now. So you can see the chain in the front. They don't want people going inside. In fact, curbside pickup only. But you can peek through the door and the window and see all of these great items they have inside. Of course, right now, as we know, kids are home. They're learning from home. So bookstores really are crucial during this time. And in fact, that's what one of the customers said. She's so grateful to be able to come here and pick up a couple things for her son. Big Box is great and it's been really helpful. Amazon's been great, but right now these are the people that we need to help. We need to help community. My hope is to see my customers and see that they are okay and try to see everybody else trying to, to do their best to protect each other still because the virus is there. But also, I hope that I can bring some fun and some more um, family time. Yeah, that's Alex, the owner of Sandcastle Tales. Such a sweet woman. Uh, she will bring whatever items people want curbside for them to pick up. She also has sanitizer and gloves and masks available for her customers, saying she'll do anything to make sure they feel comfortable because their health is her priority. Alex said she's been closed since the middle of February here in Del Mar because people just stopped coming in. She said many customers were just nervous to go shopping with COVID-19 concerns, and she really had to learn about online sales pretty quickly. Uh, she was trying online sales, uh, but even with reopening here today, she still has had a tough time paying rent in full. She's been paying as much as she could, but for that reason, she doesn't think she'll survive here in this area. She opened back in September, so it's been less than a year since she's been open. That's hard on any business, and this pandemic really has crushed her, but as we know, she's not only the only one. Her bookstore, as you can see, is full of hands-on experiences. In fact, she would have story time right in the middle of the store, but since that is no longer an option, she's been doing video storytelling on YouTube for any families who want to tune in. She also, you know, posted pictures of her toys and her books online. She really has been a dedicated business owner here. She's been texting back and forth with customers, showing them what she has in the store, even making deliveries by way of her bicycle to make sure they get the items that they need. And now they can come here, pick them up themselves right on the curb.